Hannah Reich, the world's first female professional pilot. Hannah Reich was a German aviator and a test pilot. She fly tested many of Germany's new aircraft during World War II and received many honors. Reich was among the very last people to meet Adolf Hitler alive in the Führer bunker in late April 1945. She set more than 40 flight altitude records and women's endurance records in gliding and unpowered flight before and after World War II. In the 1930s, she was sponsored by the West German Foreign Office as a technical advisor in Ghana and elsewhere and founded a gliding school in Ghana. Reich was born in Hirschberg in 1912. Her father was a doctor and her mother was a member of the Austrian nobility. In 1933, Reich left medical school to become a full-time glider pilot. In 1934, she became a member of German Research Institute for Sailplane Flight and became a test pilot in 1935. Reich enrolled in a civil airways training school in Staden, where she flew a twin engine on a cross-country flight and aerobatics in a Focke-Wolf FW-44. In 1937, she successfully tested Hans Jacobs' dry brakes for gliders. At the German Research Institute for Sailplane Flight, she tests flew transport and troop carrying gliders, including the DFS-230. Her flying skill, desire for publicity, and photogenic qualities made her a star of Nazi propaganda. She appeared in Nazi propaganda throughout the late 1930s and early 1940s. Reich was the first female helicopter pilot and one of the few pilots to fly the Falk Aculus FA-61, the first fully controllable helicopter for which she received the Military Flying Medal. In 1938, during the three weeks of the International Automobile Exhibition in Berlin, she made daily flights of the FA-61 helicopter inside the Deutsch Land Hall. In 1938, Reich flew the DFS Habicht in the Kirland National Air Races. Reich was a test pilot and the Junkers GU-87 dive bomber and Dornier DO-17 fast bomber projects for which she received the Iron Cross from Hitler in 1941. Reich was asked to fly many of Germany's latest designs, among them the rocket-propelled Messerschmitt ME-163 Comet in 1942. During the last days of the war, Hitler dismissed Hermann Göring as head of the Luftwaffe and appointed Juan Göring to replace him. Juan Göring and Reich flew to meet Hitler in the Führer bunker. In Berlin, Reich landed near the Brandenburg Gate. Shortly after midnight, on the 29th of April, Reich and Juan Göring flew out of Berlin. This was the last plane out of Berlin. Reich was soon captured along with Juan Göring and the two were interviewed together by U.S. military intelligence officers. After her release, Reich settled in Frankfurt. After the war, German citizens were barred from flying powered aircraft, but within a few years gliding was allowed, which she took up again. In 1952, Reich won a bronze medal in the World Gliding Championships in Spain. She was the first woman to camp it, and in 1955 she became German champion. She continued to break records, including the women's altitude record and her first diamond of the gold sea badge. Throughout the 1970s, Reich broke gliding records in many categories, flying along the Appalachian Ridge in the United States. Reich died of a heart attack in Frankfurt in 1979. She had never married. She was buried in a Reich family grave in Salzburg. Many thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe my channel and like and share this video.